Thanks for staying with us. I'm Ann McCloy. And I'm Cody Holyoke. How well do local hospitals protect us from infections and medical errors? Most do okay, according to recently released health grades. The exception seems to be Saratoga Hospital. Here's a look at how they stacked up. Berkshire Medical Center got an A. Albany Med, St. Peter's, and Ellis all got a B. Glens Falls Hospital got a C, but Saratoga Hospital got a D. And this is not the first time it's been well below average. Our investigative reporter Jennifer Lukey asked some tough mm -hmm. questions of the administration today. She joins us live tonight with The Real Deal. Let's have it, Jen. Well, these grades are calculated by a nonprofit called the LeapFrog Group. It surveys hospitals and uses data reported to the federal government following surgeries and hospital stays to create these grades. Now, Saratoga Hospital has been consistently below average in this survey for the past few years, but the administration told me today that patient safety and care is their number one priority. According to the report, patients who have surgery at Saratoga Hospital are more likely to have breathing problems, dangerous blood clots, and accidental cuts here compared to other hospitals. Blood and urinary tract infections are also more common in patients who stay in the hospital's ICU. In a conference call with senior management today, I was told some of the data used to make this rating is old, and they've already been working on surgical issues. In a real sense, Things that may have happened back in 2011 were recognized, addressed, and we invested the time, effort, and attention to make sure that today our surgical care is as good, if not better, than anyone else in the area. But the report also shows below average scores when it comes to having the right staff to prevent safety problems. We don't need one person being a safety officer going out there and saying save lives. Rather, we, um, we encourage a culture in which every single one of our employees um, contributes to the culture of safety, and in essence, each one of them are a safety officer. The hospital says this is the first time it voluntarily provided answers for this survey, and in some categories it scored low because of how the question was asked. Why don't your doctors order medication through the computer? They do order medication through the computer. The way the question was asked has some subtle nuances to it. Eighty-five percent of scripts are entered electronically, but confusion over the question caused Saratoga to score the worst in the country in that category. People who use or consider using Saratoga Hospital for a surgery, when they see this grade, what do you want them to know? So I want them to know that the grade is not really reflective of the care they receive. The grade reflects LeapFrog's opinion as to the processes we should have in place to deliver care. All right, so here's the real deal. If you need to choose a hospital, do your homework, review independent surveys like this one, but also take a look at the federal data about surgical outcomes and infection rates. The best advice, talk to your doctor. They may have privileges at more than one hospital and can likely advise you on the best place for your needs. Anne.